cat out the hat And I don't got a chick for a hoe just to chat Hey, I'm robbing the man who dress up like a bat Go get the paperwork if I'm a rat Bitch, hey, big boss nigga It's BP for president My Ask you something I never asked you So, on some real shit, I never even asked you this Yes What really motivated you To become such a serial entrepreneur? Of course, as a we black woman, I'm gonna say our children motivate. I ain't done. I'm gonna say okay. it because it's important. There's a lot of black women that you've been seeing. Just they, they get on the social media, they hate. <laughs> Why don't people laugh at it? <laughs> See, oh. I can't take your lies here. Come <laughs> to my page. No, 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 no. <laughs> no. <laughs> no look, I was talking. I was uh -uh. talking some shit before. I was talking shit before. Okay. You just sat down. But listen, yo, know, what? Like, as a black woman, how yeah. did you not have to seal your pussy? How did you ha not man, have to? I, I don't have nothing against the women that do that. I ain't, that. I ain't, ain't nothing against it, but I'm just saying. But I'm just going to go and see your man, questions. I don't so want my daughter out here doing that. I don't want my okay, daughter. Okay, I understand. Man. So what really motivated me, of course, we're going to say our kids, we're going to say our family, we're going to say things of that nature. But I'm going to just be honest. What really motivated me was the haters. Because I feel like, you know, when somebody hate on me and they be like, oh, she can't do this and da, 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 da I got to. Ten toes down. I gotta step on their neck. So anything, any anytime people tell me I can't do something, it's like I gotta do it. You get what I'm saying? Like anytime somebody hate on me, like you know what? I'm finna go pop it. And see, my pop it is I'm gonna go buy a Smoothie King. I'm gonna go buy a Peach Cobbler Factory. I'm gonna go do this. I'm gonna go do that. That's how I pop it. You get what I'm saying? So yeah. that is my thing. That's what motivates me. That the negativity and the hating is what motivates me. Really? Yeah. That's it. That's it. That. This, so y'all see. As y'all see, man, so you... I'm at work. Like, yeah, why y'all can't take me serious? Everybody want to take pictures. I'm in my nine to five right now. Uh, yeah. I am chilling at work. You know how many You know how many people wish they can own a nine to five instead of working at that bitch? <laughs> yeah, I'm the boss and I'm the worker. Uh, shit, you know how many people got to go clock in? And, I'm finna go scoop some, some ice cream in a minute. They get low on ice cream. How I wore yesterday? Yes. Already? They scooped a lot this morning, but... You know. Did they go buy some more? Yeah, we'll send somebody with some more. Thank you all so much. Hey. Listen. Right. But they probably got another restaurant. What, Corey? Look, you're getting my damn nerve. Don't let her fool y'all. I sure do. <laughs> and I keep telling you, I ain't worried about nobody doing nothing to me. <laughs> Y'all need to be worried about me doing something. See, see how easy access? No. Y'all need to be worried about me. Okay? Oh, man, crazy, man. You got the damn piece of my ass. Please. What I'm talking about. How much I pay an hour is different. You know, like, my GM, my GM is on salary. It's like 75, 80K a year is what I pay my general manager. That's a salary, you know. I got a lot of high schoolers. You know, my first job in high school was uh, Taco Bell. So I hired a lot of high schoolers to give them a chance, a lot of fresh college students. And so, yeah. My phone is on 5%. That's like 12. What about the phone? Man? What other phone? The other phone. The one? I, gave, I gave it to you. You were showing them the damn. The oh, thing. it must be still in the car. See, you got. See, I'll be telling you, bro. You need to be on that, that shit, too. What I be on? Don't say I don't post that to y'all anything, babe. I'm drug free. Here. Throw that away. And why people leave their drinks right there? So that gets. That, that's really getting to me. Let me check. Let Danny. I wish I had 75 for 80 a year. Um, it's a lot of stores be needing general managers, people with um with experience in the food industry. It's a lot of people be a lot of stores be needing that. What? I'm gonna set up on the inside, right by the register. Right, well, take All right. Let's try it right here. Okay. You know what I'm saying? You will sit right here, right? Stop. Sit in front of you are a real YouTuber. You have everything I need to prop my what phone. What the fuck kind of fit is that? 
What yeah, you mean? Looking like a pure bitch. Hell, I want to be on that. That's like my face. You look like a what? Pure bitch. What the fuck? Why would you do? Oh, look. Anyway, there you go. Nah. Yes, yeah, you DoorDash. DoorDash, yes. You go DoorDash, go? Uber Eats, Grubhub. Go ask Tur uh, Tanner. I always say Turner. Go ask Tanner. <laughs> go ask Tanner if we can turn on the DoorDash today in Grubhub. We couldn't even turn that on on yesterday because we were so busy y'all like we uh oh. yes. yes so we couldn't even turn on um the door days yesterday it was too busy we couldn't handle our online orders and the store orders we gonna run out of food somebody say our and money bag coke Y'all are undefeated. I promise you. If y'all do some of that energy to get you a bigger bag, y'all will be okay with me. Because I'm going to tell you something. You can talk as much shit when you got money. Y'all will be okay with me. Yeah, because you're all out the You know? Nah, I don't. I don't need no feels or no nothing. If I got a feels, it's because I want to have a fucking feels. <laughs> So yeah, like yeah, the internet is undefeated. Y'all gotta stop. I really don't like my shirt button up all the way to the top. I really look like Gangsville. I want to say that sounds so familiar. I think somebody bought that territory though. A storefront to Las Vegas would be dope. I promise it would be dope. It would be dope. It would be dope. Um, how much would I charge for ship? Right now, my class is on two ninety seven. You get mentorship with the class. I ain't that one of them type of people, you know. I heard I'm gonna add a thousand dollars to my class. Be yeah. Now I don't need the money. It ain't about the money. It's about me making sure you make a million. Yeah. It ain't about the money to me. That's why my class is two ninety seven. You should come Monday. Somebody start the door yeah, day Monday? Yeah, start today. Because, you know, we have to go early so. Monday, we get... A nice party, you got, folks. Well, this ain't start. This is for... Ari, where you at? Come on, join my life. Hey, honey, how are you? Good. Oh, they are big. Ari, join my life. So, yes, you guys, um, you want to get into the franchise? Let me know. It's a whole lot of other markets that we really need to hit or whatever. So just let me know. You want to get into the tax industry? I'm going to be honest. The tax industry is what paid me. That's what made me a multi-millionaire. And once I became a multi-millionaire, I started franchising. I have a peach cobbler factory and I have a smoothie king. So you want to make the real bag? I'm going to teach you how to do stuff the legit way. You know, like, don't get me wrong. You got, and I'm not talking about our on time i'm just talking in general because i'm a very direct person it's something that you all want something that you all want to understand hey how are you so um you know be that our own people they be trying to bring us down and another thing i want to say a lot of black people don't expect other black people to be successful they feel like we got to do something illegal to get where we had in our life they feel like we got to scam to get wherever we had in life they just feel like scammers they just feel like we just can't do it. Like we had to pull a string or something. They just feel like we don't have it in us to do it, to become multi-millionaires. So that's why so many black people, they, they look down on us and we look down on our own kind, which that got to stop. I'm just talking to again. So when I got into the test game, I didn't, it was my first year as an entrepreneur. They had taught me a scammer before I did a, a tax return. That'd be crazy. I'm like, 
how am I scamming? Because I'm charging a prep fee. That's how much I charge for my business. What is $500? What is $9.99? What is $200? That's how much I charge for my business. That's, he said, what is now? Black people want shit for free. I just want to say. Quiet, Corey. It's true. That's, that's what I charge for my business. That don't mean I'm scamming you because that's my prep fee. Scamming you is when you don't get a tax check. But it's so hard for black people to understand that because a lot of people be wanting stuff for free. You know, a lot of people be wanting stuff for free. You know, I had like an incident that happened at my store yesterday. You know, I ain't even want to go back and forth with the lady. I said, let me tell you something. Man, lady, this peach cobbler pan ain't number $10. We ain't got to do all that over there. Let me, let me just give you this, huh? You can have it, you know? So it's like one thing about it, when you elevate, it's going to be new, ne new levels, new devils. That's what I want to tell y'all, you know. If I ain't talking about you, you ain't popping shit. And one thing I, I am going to tell you about this media, um, they love to see people fold. So in the beginning, they're going to be all against you. Oh, she did, she did, she did. And when they don't see you fold, they're going to roll with you, man. They're going to roll with you. I promise you. I see I see it happening to upcoming rappers. Soon as a rapper get hot, the whole media, oh, she ugly. She did, she did, she did. Why y'all listen to her music? But soon as y'all see that rapper don't fold and she popping her shit, she standing 10 toes down, oh, y'all rolling with her then. Y'all, oh, she pretty. She Last week, she just was ugly. Last week, she just was ugly. I'm just saying. You know, y'all flip so quick. So that's why I'm trying to tell you, like, it's some black people out here that really got a bag in real life. No internet shit. It's people out here that's really get money, that's really getting a bag, that really can coach you, really can mentor you. I like it first. There you go. Eat you some, eat you some peach cob. Talk to them with your phone on 2% and cut off. I'm home. Here, I'm on you. Good. Lady too. Did you open it? Of course I did. Yeah. Let, hold on, yeah. Let me say a corporate so not to let him get in that free number. No hey, oh, 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 <laughs> I need I need my seven ninety nine for that cup of coffee. Shit. Come on, run it. I put my hours in yesterday. Oh, <laughs> no. I'm, I'm, I'm messing up the inventory. As soon as we run out today, I'm gonna think about that one piece of coffee. Come on now. Let me taste amazing. What's more? No, I want no more. I don't I don't want to eat. No free nothing. Hey. I can pay for my peach cobbler. I can pay for mine too. All right, go put seven ninety nine. Go go ring yourself up. I shot you up already. Cause you messing up my inventory like that. Real? I was out here having a real heart to heart with y'all. You could have you a know what? Heart heart that we gonna continue. That screen, okay. Two percent. We gonna continue these. So you all want to get into the franchises? Um, let me know. Um, I can let you know when Mark is available. I can let you know 